Pinky, are you ready? Yes. Hel Hello, Mommy Lou fam. Welcome back. Today we are doing a Q&A and Inky's so excited because it's her first one ever since she was a baby. And we are trying to look our best Inky. You better not get that cardigan dirty. It was really expensive. Don't worry, I won't. And also, I am wearing my cowboy, cowgirl outfit. And I did my makeup nicely, very heavy, because we're trying to look our best for our first ever Q&A ever since I've started this channel. And I even did my nails for this. And look at my my little baby Angie. Anki has been so jealous lately because I've been paying too much attention to Angie. <laughs> All right, Anki, come over here. We should. Do you want to sit on the couch or these two? Um, these two. Okay, okay. So, Anki, are you ready? Definitely. Okay. Also. Hope and Phoebe aren't here today because they're at preschool and daycare. But don't worry, I will answer their questions because anyway, if they were here, they wouldn't know how to answer. Oh my goodness, Andy, are you okay? Your your eyes are like staring at the screen so close. Okay, I think you'll be fine. She just wants to have a little peek. So, we are going to have questions from you guys, of course, the Mummy Lou fam. And of course, we also have questions from family and friends. And, of course, we can ask questions for each other, which will be so fun. Okay, so we're going to start... Okay, Inky, so we're going to start questions with the with you guys, okay? So, your questions were... Okay, so I might say some of the names. Some of them I won't say, but... The first one I will... Which is Bonnie Plays because she has been commenting on my channel for like a while now. So, Bonnie Plays, thank you for commenting. And also, her question was Are you gonna upload again? Now, am I gonna upload again? Of course, I will upload for you guys. But it's just been, it's just like we have a lot going on recently, you know. With baby Angie being here, Lindsay being in town, of course, grandma and grandpa as well, and also we went to Canada. Just too many things, okay? And he has a new school starting as well soon. <laughs> so we had a few meetings and interviews, but yeah, we're back again, so of course I will upload for you guys. And never fear because we will upload again. And also, Bonnie Plays says, hi. So, hello, Bonnie Plays. Hopefully, that made your day. All right, Aki, would you do the honors and read the next question? Okay. All right, Aki. So, let me just... Okay, okay. I don't think you can see from here. It's okay. Let me just... You there, scroll through. Nope, not this one. Okay. Not yet. Okay, Inky, are you ready to read the question or? Yep. Okay, read it. So the question here is, are you going to have any more kids? Are you kidding? Okay, okay, okay. You know what? You know what? Fine, I'll answer this. But I must say, okay, you guys, so you're asking if I'm going to have any more kids. Now, that is a very hard question because we just had this little munchkin right over here. We just adopted a new born, so I don't think I'm ready for to take care of another newborn, so maybe not. But you know what? Last time we adopted baby Hope, we said no more kids, no way. But you know what? 
a year later, look what happened. So you never know, okay? So keep your hopes up, guys. But yeah, Anki, are you hoping for any siblings? Well, I don't really hope so. But if they have a good behavior, then I will accept them. <laughs> Very good answer. But Anki, I know this is a question from them, but if you were to, you know what? Maybe that's part of the questions. You know what? We'll ask that later. If it's not part of the question. Okay, last question from the Mommy Lou fam. So, are you going to go back to Brookhaven with Inky? You know what? Good question. We do used to live in Brookhaven, which was amazing. But we have realized that Brookhaven, as good as it is, they have a few bad things, which is that people always rob the bank. Like, it's not safe there. You know, what if we're trying to get our money and then someone came here to rob it? We could easily get threatened by somebody. And we have kids, okay? Ba baby Phoebe, Phoebe was just a baby when we were when we were there. We didn't want I didn't want the kids to get frightened. Anki was only seven, so I didn't want the kids to be that scared. So we just moved away. Another reason is our neighbors house it's just getting constructed and plus i always see them going out at night i don't know if they are the ones robbing the bank or not it's just not safe but holiday yeah i will think about it plus it's like a five hour road trip so i don't know about going back but holiday sure we could take a plane so Here's your answer. We will go back for holiday someday, but about for moving back, maybe not for like at least a couple more years. But good question because it's true. So Anki, why don't you? Okay, I'm gonna record you, Anki, so you can you can say something about moving back to Brookhaven. Would you like to do that? Um. Well, Brookhaven's a nice place. And we made some great memories there. But here, we're already doing a lot of things. So moving back to Brookhaven would cost a lot of tiling and signing and stuff. Because as you know, I'm going to be moving to a new school. Oh, yes. I forgot to tell you, Anki is moving to a new school. And we are so excited. Her teacher this year is Miss Jen. Miss Jennifer, Jen's just for short, but anyway, moving back, so those are all the questions you guys had for us, now we should do family, okay, and of course friends, so we have a few questions from friends, which I'm not going to say their name, because I don't know if they want to be on camera or not, but we have a few questions from grandma and grandpa, also aunt Lindsay, so let's uh, Inky, do you want to answer the question from Grandma and Grandpa first? Or do you want to answer the question from Aunt Lindsay first? Mm. Um, Aunt Lindsay this time. Okay. So, let's find Aunt Lindsay, shall we? Okay. So she is, should we do yours first or mine first? Uh, yours. Okay. So she says, Chloe, what is something you do that is Wait, wait, let me just read that again because I am totally messed up with my pronounce, pronunciation. What is something you do just to be different? Oh, well, that's a very good question, Lindsay. Now, Lindsay, I don't get why you're asking me this question because we grew up together, so I'm pretty sure she should know that. But if not, then here's your answer. So what do I do to be different? Now... I would say 
adding spicy sauce well, and soy sauce to nearly everything I eat, okay? I don't add everything spicy sauce, but soy sauce I love. So unless it's something else like pizza or something, I wouldn't really add. I would add soy sauce. So that's just something I like, but... For Anki, she thinks it's gross, okay? Anki thinks that adding soy sauce to your rice and stuff is disgusting, but I don't really see a problem to it. I always cook with soy sauce. Well, okay. sometimes it can be weird. Yeah. Okay, Lindsay has three questions for me. So, the second question is, why do you think you became the person you are today? Wow, that's actually a really good question, Lindsay. I am happy that my little sister finally get to ask me a good question. Well, Lindsay, here's your answer. Now, um, I became the person I am today because I adopted four amazing kids and they have just been so cu cute and nice for the entire time ever since I adopted Inky. So the reason I became the person I am today is because of my four kids that I have to take care of. And the third question is, what is the stupidest thing you've ever done? Well, Lindsay, got to be honest, but once, remember those new jeans I bought? Well, I had some old ones that were like really, that were, didn't even fit me. So I decided to give it to one of my friends because it, it fitted them because they were smaller than me. They were one size smaller than me, and it was in their size. So, I gra So I like to fold my jeans. You know that, Anki, right? Because I am neat and organized, unlike my kids. So, then I just grabbed a pair of jeans, and I just put it in the bag, and I gave it to my friend. And then the next day, I received a call, and she said... Oh my goodness, these jeans you gave me are so big. And then I realized I gave her the wrong bag. It was my new jeans. So there you go. That was the most stupidest thing I've ever done. <laughs> okay, That's funny. Yeah, it is a little hilarious. Okay. Inky, it's your turn, and Lindsay has a few juicy questions for you. Okay, bring them on. Okay, what is the best achievement you've ever received? Like the big, the best achievement you ever did. Okay, wait, wait, let me just zoom in you. There you go. What's your biggest achievement you ever made? Mm -hmm. My biggest achievement is probably getting um, an A plus in one of my tests. Yes, she did. Yeah. But I must say, I thought it was actually going to be the time where she passed her test and got ungrounded, but okay, okay. Lindsay also asked, Aunt Lindsay was asked. Okay. How do you picture your future? Um, I picture my future very successful with lots of challenges ahead. Very good answer. So the last one is, and the last one is, what is your favorite subject at school? Lindsay, come my on. Why are you asking Inky these questions? My favorite subject? Well, this is a quite easy one. I really like art class because it's super fun. I knew it. 
But you know what, you guys? Lindsay might have asked right because you guys don't know yet. But yes, it is art. She loves art. That's why we... Okay, so the next question is from Grandma and Grandpa. Okay, for me, are you kidding me? Mom, Dad, do you really have to ask me these questions? What is the most expensive item I ever purchased? Okay, fine, I have to be honest. Um, the most expensive item I ever purchased were these earrings over here. Nah, I'm just kidding. It was my Gucci purse. <gasps> oh, yeah. Plus Chanel purse. They were nearly the same price, but... Yeah, those two are really expensive, but you know what? I worked hard for it. Oh, wait, actually, no. If you're saying items, as in my clothes and those are, but the most expensive item I ever purchased was the cafe, the bakery. I actually work there now, if you guys didn't know, and yes, I purchased the entire bakery. That was the most expensive item I ever purchased. Okay. Okay. Next one is... Let's see. What is the best Wi-Fi name I've ever seen? Are you kidding me? Mom, Dad, I'm not supposed to be spilling these personal questions. Okay, you guys. I'm not going to say whose Wi-Fi this is, but I'm just going to say the funniest, the best Wi-Fi name I've ever seen was... I can't say it, okay? But you know what? It was kind of hilarious. The best Wi-Fi name. And quite hard to guess. But you know what? I'm not saying it because, you know, I don't want to spread any private information. Okay, you guys? So, I'm sorry I cannot answer that question, but... Okay, now next question. What is the best type of cheese? Okay, do you really have that bad of an old memory? I, I ate this cheese for like so long when I was a kid. So I love cheddar cheese. Okay, cheddar cheese. I don't get why my parents are asking me these questions because apparently... I have been eating cheddar cheese for like the, my entire childhood, so I don't get why they forgot, but Anki, this is for you. How do you feel about putting pineapple on pizza? Um, well, uh, sorry for those pineapples on pizza lovers, but it's not my favorite. Yeah, you know... I do love Hawaiian pizza, though, but you know what? I do kind of like pineapple on pizza. It's quite good, but yeah, it's just not really a thing when pizza just came out. Okay. So, apparently your grandparents only gave you these questions. One question, but. We're moving on. Sorry, guys, this video is a bit long, but we're just trying to ask questions, you know? Okay. So, next question. Which probably will be one of our, our second last question. Because we have to eat lunch soon, Anki. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, this is from one of my friends. Um, let me just show you, Anki. You know this one, right? You know her, right? Yeah. Okay. So she asked, Anki, how do you feel about being a big sister? Well, honestly, it can be very, very 
hard working sometimes, especially when you get less attention and they're always kind of whining and crying, you yes. know. Yes, Hope and Phoebe and Angie always do cry and keep Inky up. Yeah. Okay. But I'm used to it. Okay, so the last question we're going to ask, and then it's, and now I'm going to ask you a few questions. So, Inky, the last question is, if you were to have another sibling, would it, would you choose a baby brother or a baby sister? Wow, this is truly a hard choice. I honestly have never much experience of having a baby brother, so I would like to try, but I'm kind of nervous just in case they're worse or better. So right now I'd stick with this safe option, which would be baby sister, because I am now an expert. Yes, Inky has three little sisters. Can you believe that? Girls, girls, all girls, not even one boy. So maybe in the future, the person who asked if I'm ever gonna have more kids, maybe in the future, I could have more babies that are boys. Because it would be tr fun to have a son. But, okay, so I'm going to ask you a question now and then we're going to go say goodbye to the Mommy Lou fam because apparently we have been recording for a while now and we are, and I am starving. So, last question, Inky. So... I've been dying to actually ask you this question right now, but hang on. Wait, what was that on the window? Okay, let me just go outside and check. What was that? What was that? Okay. Oh, probably just a bird. Okay, Inky. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay. So. What is, are you jealous of your siblings? Very, very, very nice question. It depends how much the attention they're getting. Sometimes I feel ignored. Oh, come on, Inky. You know your siblings are young. And also, you guys, I've been realizing a lot of you have been asking, how old are my kids? So, Inky is 10, just turned 10. Hope is going to be, Hope's one right now. She will turn two in, in about, like, let me see, five months. Angie is three months, and Phoebe is... Um, four years old. Yep, they're all grown up now. But anyway, you guys, that is will be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for your questions. And if I have missed out any, please do not get upset because I will try my best. I did try my best to answer. And also, I will be trying to do shout outs right now. So please make sure you comment. All you have to comment down is Mamulu Fam and Mamulu Fam Forever, and you could have a chance on getting a shout out. But anyway, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Bye. Say bye, Inky. Bye. Bye. Make sure you like and subscribe.